I get burned out last year and I scarred me. I scarred for my life now at 82. Load the boat, draft board, snake and leather, make blackboard, iron board and all them stuff there. I make. But right now I load the board now, make and draft board. And how long you been doing that? Uh, about 20 years. What keep you going? Most people would have retired by money, now. Money man, I don't make the money all the time. Because every time, every time I go to the hardware, the things then raise up. And I can't raise the load of board because poor people think. And I try to raise the load of board, then I buy now. How and much do you sell a load of board for? Well, I sell for like $2,000, $3,000, $3,500. And I sell at a wholesale price. Like the other people, them who sell it, them buy it from me and sell back. So I sell at a wholesale price. Sometimes I just sell all two for a week. So you know that not going away. Because big time, I even sell four. Big time, I go to hardware and come back. I don't have money left. I only have money to buy me food and then something. But through my trade, I have to just live with it and go on with it. I mean, that's sick man, you know. I get burned out last year and I scarred me. I scarred for my life now at 82. Me and my two sons get burned out and only food the poor one help me. Nobody else, only food the poor. I have nobody else with me, only them one help me. And I start back now, I do a little thing to see if I can help myself. I need a little money, man, to give me a little help. Mm -hmm. Get some more supply. And we could even get one four or five sheets of fly to help me out. Look how further in the building is my business better. But it's not nobody for help me. Yeah. Bring that cool, bad, 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 bad. Because I know dear girls with you. Yeah. Some people don't know dear just to cool behave. Mm -hmm. Because it's a sneaking disease, this is. Sneaking. So how you how you feel about the people saying COVID is not real and the government must No man they go COVID real man. Then I look on news and look all over the world what's going on. This thing I real they have all one next one I come one next sick I come up, you know. The one next sick I come up, but I don't know if I make them I make it in a lab. But my mind tells me so if the lab man them I stir up these things and it would have helped. Plenty because the vaccine alone now nah go help. Because the people them, some of my people them, no one taking the other people them. I, I be swear the other people them say, no take it because it's gonna kill you. The other one say, no take it, it's gonna make you sick. And if you not take it, it will kill you same way. So it's it better you take the vaccine until them get a better vaccine. At all times, a better one will come in because the vaccine coming from different, different countries mm -hmm. coming in here. So, you will get a better one. So, so what? would I encourage the people them, to take it till something come up better and cut down this virus because this virus will take half a Jamaica as far as I see. It will kill half a Jamaica and no time and the people don't take it serious. But it's a serious thing. Because so, when the government has to do social distance, the people them still not social distance to the people who have the virus. And the people who have the virus, they move so fast. And then they go so much different, different places. You know, one day then they got virus all 200 people. So you can imagine four or five people have a virus and move up and down how much people get the virus in one year because the people them don't take it serious. 